Hello, my lovely Leo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Leos, welcome to your dailies. This will be for the 14th and the 15th of February. Happy Love Day, today and every day. And let's see here, my loves, what we got for you. What we have from the Wisdom of the Oracle was the message for today. For some of you, could be just an advice. And of course, we have the deck of Sexual Tarot for overall energies for this daily and our Radiant White Spirit Tarot. Let's see here, Leos, what we got for you. All that glitters, beautiful. But I feel here, whatever who you are connected, they are very superficial. I can tell you very, very much. And that could be you, my loves. But I feel here, the energy of a yin, very predominant here, which that speaks to me is let them do more for you than you for them but let's see here number 16 card what's that meaning and of course how we're moving forward the 16 card all that glitters the essential meaning of the card i need to see beyond the superficial the desire to don a mask or dress something up to disgust its true nature trying to be something you are not chasing after every sparkly new thing being mercurial in regards to the relationship sometimes we try to become something we are not to impress others we embellish a story a bit adding some dramatic element to make us more appealing the real person becomes hidden behind the sparkle and shine then there are times when we don't see the true value of somebody else because he or she may not have the glitz and glamour that seem so desirable. Now is the time to look past the surface, beyond the mask, to the essence of a person, who that person is, not what he or she has or can give you is important. See beyond the glitter and look for the inner glow. Use the eyes in your heart. Let go of artifice and let what is authentic shine. Spirit invites you, my loves, to be very authentic, be you. If it's somebody who is very interested in you, what you are in them, be true to yourself. Be honest with them. Also, be you. I always tell people, when I do meet somebody, I am me. I am just me. That's why what you see here, this is me. No matter what, this is what I do my best and I want you to see my true nature. So Leos, pay attention to those qualities in a person or in a situation. Let's see here, since I've been invited by the Spirit to see this deck, to use this deck for this daily. I bought this deck probably three years ago and never used it here on the channel and today I was very much drawn to it. Your over energy we have the hangman. We have death. Something which was stagnant is changing. And we have eight of cups. Somebody here is walking away from something which been felt stuck. Knight of Pentacles, oof, so slow moving. But look here how beautiful energies are here. The hangman, whatever you're hanging on or whatever kept you stuck, it is over with death. You can connect here with the water sign, my lovely Leo. Doesn't need to be, but I definitely see here water energy for many, many of you. Let's see here, loves, what we got. It's midnight here, and probably you'll see this reading tomorrow morning, since I will put them overnight to be uploaded. So, yes, we just passed 12 a.m. Whatever it is here, my loves, there is something changes. Whatever you felt stuck, there's not anymore. Let's see here, my loves, Leos, Sun, Moon, Rising, Sign, and Venus, Science, 
general readings as always. Nine of Wands. For some of you, it's like, why didn't work this connection? What was all about this connection? For some of you, you do have a lot of questions. The Devil, Capricorn energy, oof, was a sexual connection, my loves? Or you are second guessing, was love or was just sex between us? Some of you are not feeling moved on. You might be connected here with the water or an earth. Let's see. And yes, somebody here is guessing this was a relationship, a codependent relationship or not. Knight of Pentacles, twice. Spirit says don't lie to yourself. Keep moving. Keep moving. Anyway, this person was not the right for you. Or at least their energy was not matching with yours. Was very much a breadcrumb energy here. You do know that. Whatever this person left or how they left, you now know what is the purpose. Could be somebody very much into finances, but I feel here somebody here was going to extreme with, you know, inner sexual energy or even other things here. It's like they play with the fire here type. Very much, I don't know if I want to settle down. When you probably ask them what we are, we are a couple, we are together, we are not. Like he's like, or she is like, I don't know. You feel like you cannot find an answer where we are. We are just friends or we are a couple because the intimacy was awesome things was moving slow very slow because one of you was not really there or the connection was not truthful and again we go back to all the glitters it's like one was just receiving one was just giving 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 this couldn't end up in a bit in a hard bit here and one of you is healing it's working on a healing pattern. Anyway, you knew that this is not stable. Or now you are thinking, what was all about? Was it stable? Was not stable? What was this person for in my life here? You're still thinking, but I don't see you still stuck. In the past, yes, you are big time stack 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 but right now I feel here you it's kind of a grown-up mind you do find like why did I stay there why I not enjoy it like for some of you just basically closed everything out there like no friendships no going out and now you might found out that this person was in a third party that's why they acted how they acted here. We have three, three in here. And we have the cheater here, the three. And that's why. For some of you, you blame yourself that you are not that wow for this person. Or you feel like you are not enough. And again, my loves, you are always enough. If you are not enough, you are not close to that person. Not even a uh, hundred feet. And this connection could go on and off for over two years. Three of Pentacles could be a work partner. Very childish. Very small. And yes, it's like when you try to talk about them with them. Can we this? Can we work? Or is this connection work? And what's the reason? I feel here this person was like, uh-uh. Seven of Pentacles. For some of you, definitely you waited for a better outcome or you waited for something more for this person. It's like, I, I thought you are more than what, what you give or what you've done. You wanted to talk, but I feel here this person is not able. I don't feel them do too much. And I feel here I'm talking with a single Leo. 
Although I see you very communicative, my lovely dear. Flip the energy, slums. Flip the energy if it's not you. Somebody here does want a new beginning. If this person didn't want to commit in the past, they do want to commit now or commitment. For some of you, a slight chance for you. For those of you who are being in a third party, there was kids involved. Also, somebody here could be married and you could find out later on. Because I feel here you got so many questions and at some point slowly but surely you find out that this person could have a family or even kids but this person make a, such a big stagnation into your life and yes in a very short time you are about to have a new beginning it's like I do want a new beginning but it's kind of they when they left or whatever happened left you like like all over the place yeah there's some truth coming here I ask what's about the tower there's some truth about this connection because I feel here you still love this person but I feel here if this person shows up or texts you back it's it's mostly for closure because I don't see you my loves with this person I see you walking away on a new path but with clarity yeah for some of you you find out that this person was married here you are my love you've been watching them or you've been seeking information about them but now you are very clear what that was about and how that was although Sometimes I see you feeling melancholically thinking of them. But whatever you've been stagnant here, I, I see a very stagnant Leo. Because I feel here you did love this person. But whatever they've done to you, oof. You, you feel is a no, no. That's why I see you walking away from this person. With this Eight of Cups. And I see you... You might be at the distance right now, but I see you on a new path. You're manifesting something new. That's beautiful, my loves. It's like you you get yourself back. Yeah, absolutely. And death energy twice. There is a lot of things about to change, my loves. Leos, there's a lot of things are about to change. And... Look at here, my loves. There is something way stable coming here. Beautiful. For some of you, you've been dealing with this in another past life. And they came into your life. They enter into your life for a reason. But I feel here now, you are taking care of yourself. Let's see here an advice. An advice for the lovely Leos. High Priestess, follow your intuition, my loves. And if you feel it's over, it's over. For, for many of you, you changed a lot. Or a lot of things are about to change into your life. For some of you, Leo, you have somebody new coming into your life. You sense it. Is there a water sign strongly here? But I see you still confused. I see you still putting a lot of work into your emotional state. But definitely it is somebody here. For some of you, this person you've been dealing, they are apologizing. It's kind of they're asking for another chance. But I don't see you giving too much credit for that or too much energy into that because now you know who who and what you gotta go and what to do for some of you it is a Pisces strongly coming towards you or an air sign Gemini, Libra, Aquarius yes my loves this is what I got 
and thank you for watching and being here on the channel blessings to all of you and if you are the part of the family a subscriber here bless your day and if you are new and you want to be part of this beautiful family please do subscribe like share and comment this videos thank you and we'll see you next time namaste